So, let's now apply our system to neural decoding in neuroscience, in the example of movement decoding. So, in neuroscience, one experiment that people often do is they have people move the arm to the right, front, left, right, um, and then record how many spikes they get from various neurons. How will the data look like, uh, like for those things? Here is just an example for, for giving you the flavor for that. On the x-axis, we have 35 neurons. We have only movements to the left and only movements to the right. And what you see color-coded is the number of spikes that we get per second from those neurons. And what you can see is, by just squinting at that, you see in the lower half, this, the activity is a little different to the upper half. And from this, we now want to decode the neural recordings. So we know from past experience here that uh, the activity of neurons is proportional to the x dot, uh, to the uh, x dot, the x velocity, and y dot, the y velocity. They call it cosine tuning for historical reasons. So we know that from previous research, which suggests that we should be able to do meaningful linear decoding of the velocities here. And now, let's solve this for mean squared error. We give you the data loader, we give you the training loop, and now you optimize the mean squared error using PyTorch.